I'm just rambling right now, so I'm gonna leave. But, oh! Okay, they all just fell down. Oh my god. And welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah. Today is a very exciting day because we are going to go to Barnes & Noble for some cozy bookstore shopping. There is nothing more that I like doing than just walking around a bookstore and just nothing but vibes. And I'm also going to show you some other books that I have gotten from Amazon recently. But I feel like bookstore shopping is just like the ultimate fall activity for me. <laughs> now pumpkin picking and apple picking are good as well. Love that, of course. But like bookstore shopping, just walking around in a cozy sweater. Oh yeah. Look at my shirt. The fourth wing. I just got this delivered like yesterday. It's from Thread by Sabrina on Etsy and it's a fourth wing sweatshirt and it is so cozy and oversized and it is everything that I want in a cozy sweater and I felt like I was dressing in theme for this book store vlog. Yeah, I also was pretty productive today. It is only like 12, 18 and I have cleaned since like pretty much 8 a.m. Like I have been non-stop getting things done for four hours and I feel good and now I feel like I can reward myself to get my car washed and then I have to go return something at Home Goods and then of course I get some more fall candles because of course. And then the main event is our bookstore trip. It is a very nice fall day outside in New Jersey. I feel like it's like 50s, 60s weather but it's really sunny which is like perfect for me. So yeah, that is what we're gonna do. So 
we are back. We are in the car after our trip to Barnes and Noble. And I have, oh, this is heavy. Oh, six books to show you today. I got one book from Barnes and Noble, four books from Amazon because I went a little bit crazy during their Prime Day deals day, one book from Book of the Month. So we're just gonna go through all six of them. I just, I love Barnes and Noble, I really do. It's just, it gives me so much serotonin. We'll start with what I got from Barnes and Noble. I got Cassandra Clare's new Barnes and Noble exclusive edition book, Sword Catcher. It is beautiful, first of all, and the inside has a map. We love maps in fantasies and then also because it's a Barnes and Noble exclusive edition it has like character depiction posters so I am excited to look all through those I am just so excited to read this book because it has been everywhere I've been waiting and waiting and waiting to get it so I had a Barnes and Noble trip coming up because I wanted this exclusive edition and Cassandra Clare is actually the author of the Mortal Instruments series, which is a book series that I read when I was in like high school. I read the whole Mortal Instruments series, which I think is like six books, and then I read her Infernal Devices series, and I started her Last Hours series, so I love her writing, and I am just excited to get into this newest book. Before we get into the Amazon ones, I wanted to show you this book of the month book. I got Starling House by Alex E. Harrow. This is actually my first book of the month book, and I am so excited. They had like a code, like spooky online that you could get a book for $5, so I signed up, and I've been seeing this book everywhere. It is very spooky season type vibes. So there is an author that lives in the Starling house, and it's like a lot of mystery surrounding that house, and then I think Opal starts dreaming about it, and then she gets to like digging around to see what is up with Starling House. It seems like a little mystery, and I am very excited to read this one. I got The Prison Healer and Gilded Cage, and I think the third one's called The Blood Trader, and that one's on the way, but I got these two first. These are the first two books in the Prison Healer series by Lynette Noni. They also have very beautiful covers. I have just been in such a fantasy mood, so I am so excited to get into another fantasy series. Like, I will read all the fantasy series if I possibly could. Seems to be about this 17 year old Kiva where basically she is the prison healer and I guess she has some some like healing powers. She receives a coded message from her family that basically says don't let the rebel queen who gets sent to prison. There's these trials which is like elemental challenges that she has to endure so I guess I'm not gonna read the summary of the second one because I don't want any spoilers, but those are our two books that we got from Amazon. And then we got this one from Amazon too. This is One Dark Window by Rachel Gillig. What really intrigued me to get it is in the beginning of all the chapters, there are these like cards, which I guess are clues, and she has to follow these clues. And that's all I already know about it, but I just like the idea that each chapter started with a clue and it seems like a little mystery or like a spell or something. It is very fall vibes, and I am very excited to read this one. And then the last book that I'm gonna show you that I bought from Amazon is Red Rising by Pierce Brown. This is gonna be my first sci-fi book, I'm pretty sure. But Haley Fahm on here was obsessed with this book, and and I usually like all the books that she likes, so I figured I would try it out. I would try out Pierce Brown because he's a very famous sci-fi author. And I just figured that I would give it a try. That is the last book that I got. And those are the, oh, let me see if I can do this. Those are the six books that I have for this book haul for you today. I am super, super excited to get into all of these, honestly. And I just, I can't wait. And then also in Barnes & Noble, there was a lot of cute little Christmassy books. And I am just so excited to get into the Christmassy books too. So yeah, I am, I'm just having a great bookish time lately. That was my book haul. I'm probably gonna include these in some reading vlogs, so look out for that. That is gonna be it from me today. I am so happy we went on this Barnes & Noble trip. Much needed. It's been a while since we've done a Barnes & Noble vlog, and I just, it's like a withdrawal. I get a withdrawal from it. I'm just rambling right now, so I'm gonna leave, but, oh! 
Okay, they all just fell down. Oh my god. Ah! It's okay, they're okay. All the books are okay. I will talk to you next time. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.